versatile future sea craft will lead to a total rethink and let us experience the ocean in brand new ways. What is it? What's it do? Is it an airplane? Is it a boat? Or is it a submarine? We want to jump higher than anything else. We want to try and do bigger tricks. I mean, we're trying to replicate what a lot of, you know, aquatic animals can do. What if you could cross a dolphin with a jet ski? Exploring the heights and depths of the ocean in ways never before seen. Rob Innes sees a future where you can push the limits of water sports to new extremes. It's just a blast. It's something that that's just pure enjoyment. It just creates something that's totally fun, totally awesome to drive. If it looks like a dolphin and acts like a dolphin, then it's a sea breacher. Part power boat, part submarine. Sea Breacher is more than just a pleasure craft. It's about the experience of swimming like a dolphin in the sea. Like an airplane in reverse, the Sea Breacher is able to dive beneath the surface by creating a negative lift with its wings and forcing the craft down. You're in a totally three-dimensional environment. You really feel like part of the water. It, it's a strange experience, but when you go underwater and you're in an entire bubble of air underwater, it makes the water more alive. Powered by a supercharged rotary engine coupled to a V-drive transmission, Sea Breacher flies at 40 miles an hour across the water's surface. 20 miles an hour underneath five times faster than a regular recreational submersible. In the future, for less than the price of a new BMW, you can choose instead to dive into the water and swim with the dolphins. Imagine, you know, what the potential will be. You can dive with them, swim with them. And even learn some tricks from them. That median between the two environments is something that, that dolphins have been exploring for a long time. You know, you might be able to go down with them to, you know, 20, 30 feet and beyond. For now, we're limited in terms of depth and duration, but with what dolphins are able to do, I think, you know, staying with a pot of dolphins, how can you beat that? Sometimes when you do like two or three barrel rolls in a row, it's a neat thing to see your entire world turn upside down. I mean, you're half underwater and you're half in the air. You jump as high as you can, then you dive as deep as you can. You're at the mercy of the elements when you do this. Ultimately, a boat this athletic is born to compete. Imagine scores of sea breachers racing in huge ocean sports arenas. Think motocross in the sea. I think the racing is going to be a sport where thousands of spectators will actually be able to watch these vessels compete in a 3D environment of air and water, jumping over obstacles, diving under things, trying to hit targets. Obviously, there'd be wrecks that would entertain the crowd, but we see a, a, just a huge mass sporting appeal. Obviously there'll be other applications. People can use them to get out to their islands and yachts. The sky will be the limit.